Welcome to My Long Island TV. From Manhasset to Montauk, we have traveled our communities to bring you the following events. I'm your host, Waldo Cabrera. My Long Island TV starts now. Welcome to our 11th annual juried photography show. We're having it on Main Street Petite Gallery at the Huntington Arts Council. We have at least 40 artists, members that are in this show, and that's out of the 316 that were entered. You don't have to be living on Long Island or a member of the Arts Council. Our last show, a girl entered from Sweden. So it does, we are it's open to, there's no age minimums, no age maximums. Well, through my work on Long Island at the Long Island Railroad Public Art Projects, my name was uh, put forward to be a juror for this show, and it was a great opportunity to see a lot of interesting work by local people. And the theme, A Day on Long Island, really it captures anything that you would want it to. So it brought in a lot of different types of photography. And what's interesting for me is to see the people's sort of perspective on what they value about where they live, you know, what causes them to stop and click the camera. So it was a lot of fun, a great opportunity. Anybody can pick up a camera now and click, and everyone does, but to really get the light right, the subject matter, and to convey what you're feeling about what you're looking at, that takes art, and that's what I was looking for. I decided to, you know, not think too globally about what people expect, and I went with what I liked and what I responded to. And the happy kids in an amusement park, a rainbow in the woods, you know, a day at the beach, you know, with the ocean looking like glass. Those images just captured perfectly, you know, a mood and a moment, and that's what I picked. You know, so much photography depends on luck and then skill. So uh, that day, both were going my way. We were uh, actually going out east to East Hampton, and this rainbow appeared, and I just luckily had my camera with me. Stopped the car, jumped out, and, and found the best possible place I could to get that picture. There is a lot of really good work in this show. I'm very impressed. Uh, most shows, I don't think, have the level of uh, expertise that this show is showing. And I'm really proud to be part of this whole group. Well, I was taking pictures this day at, uh, at Adventureland of my daughter and her friend. And I, I, I really didn't expect to get it. Um, I took This was one of many that I took that day. The other ones were, were, I waited for the sun to go down. And a lot of them were lights, you know, with time exposures. And so when I saw this one, I was like, wow, you know. I look for everything. I look for the beauty and everything that I that is a picture of. Um, it could be, any, I, I do a lot of landscapes as well. But I find that um, I, I'm, I'm starting to do more people and, and live action and, and things like that. Well, my favorite place in the whole world is Montauk, out on Long Island. And I go to Ditch Plains quite frequently. And I went out there at 5 o'clock. This was last summer. And there was this gorgeous sunrise. And then I was lucky enough to find the fishermen with his car there, which completed the image for me. I always have a camera with me everywhere I go. You have to be ready for that special moment. It's how I spend every free moment that I have, either out taking images or sitting at the computer working on the images. 